Hello and welcome everybody to Terraria Journeys and Breakdown, aka Terraria 1.4 Trailer Breakdown. We're gonna break down the trailer here, and I know some people have done it already. For example, uh, Chippy, go check out his video. Probably did better than me or better than I'm about to do. But what we're about to do is every time we see something new, you know, we're gonna pause the video, we're gonna point it out, we're gonna try and keep track of everything that's new. Let's do it. We already got some new stuff right here. Right when, right when the intro cuts in. We're gonna start with a cloud in the background, new new cloud shapes. I don't know if this will just happen randomly or what. There's also these birds over here. I don't, I don't know if birds in Terraria be flying like that on the normal, but they're in like a weird U shape. I don't think I've ever noticed that in the background. But yeah, let us. What else can we notice here? Right off the bat, obviously they're placing the blocks in a new way. There might be a new block somewhere here too. I don't see a new block. See new flowers. These flowers might be new. I don't remember seeing flowers like that. Same thing with this. The Marigold Sprite got upgraded. But obviously the mini map is new. And there's something green on the mini map. You see that? I hope you can see my mouse. I hope OBS is picking up my mouse. But there's something green right there. I don't know what that is. But interesting. Okay, interesting. Here we're in the, the mushroom biome. Obviously we got uh, some like hanging mushrooms. They're like stalagmites, stalactites, whatever ones are the ones that point downwards. But there's that. Um, I don't think there's anything else new in here i'm pretty sure there isn't oh here we go so we got the xenon moss in the top left xenon moss that's what they're what they're carrying the thing is let's go back a little bit because as you can see journey zen is just right here on the fucking screen and i can't see anything but it's all good i'll take my mouse off look xenon moss that's about it that's the only new thing in their inventory and obviously the blue moss everywhere the minecart is new that's another thing that's new then there's krypton moss and is that a new weapon? I think he's carrying a new weapon right here. A, a green mine card. The mine card's green. Let me let me see. Mouse off the screen. Nah, it's just a staff. It's not a new weapon. Okay, so an Argon Moss. And then also another red mine card. So what I think for the mine cards is you can make them out of gems. Because we've seen a red one, a green one. I think the other one was blue. So I'm pretty sure you can make those out of gems. And then this moss, obviously, you get somehow. I don't know. But there's a new item in the third slot. New item in the third slot spotted. Look at it. Ready? What is that? I don't know. <laughs> it looks really weird. Uh, all I can say is just there's a new item there. I don't know what the hell it is. Wait, there's something else. You think you could trick me? Wait, okay. So remember, this, okay, this one wasn't blue. I was talking about how there's like gem carts, but this one looks like a train. Like, because it's shooting out steam and everything too. So I didn't even know that. I thought this one was just blue. So this one's green. Next one is red. But look, you seen that? I seen that. There's like a little imp. It looks like a purple imp. So a good bit of new stuff there. They might have been wearing new armor too. Maybe. I don't know. This vanity all looks new. Like it looks like there might be face paint or something. Because these guys all look like they had like a face paint on. But obviously we got the new menu. Uh, the new UI for making your character. This this stuff looks cool. You can see all, all of this stuff. It's a lot easier to make your character now. And I like that. Now the weird thing here with uh you know making the new world small, medium, large. You know the normal settings. But then we get here normal and expert. We know that master mode is now a new thing. Where is master mode? here is this something you have to unlock by beating the game in expert i think that'd be cool i think you had to beat the game in expert once to unlock master mode but at the same time be like already played through expert i mean i guess everyone's gonna play through the game again right unless you unless you guys are one of those people that just plays the game when there's a new update and you just play the same world it's kind of boring but you know to each their own obviously right here we got these new sub biomes slash mini biomes these this is what i'm hyped for the most because i love when games have biomes and structures just like scattered around it makes the world feel so much more alive feels like there's a presence there feels like the people have been there you know it just makes the world feel alive and uh obviously palm trees got a new texture i'm expecting there's a lot of new textures for a lot of things for example the rocks over here got a new texture there's a duck which i'm assuming is a critter it's like a desert duck dragonfly i don't know if there's dragonflies in the game obviously we got the cattails is that what this is called i don't remember uh, the mini map, of course. Now, the clothes they're wearing, I'm not going to say too much about vanity because I'm assuming 90% of the vanity they wear in this slash armor is all new. And just, just keep that in mind for now. now. Obviously, he's got a new item. He's got Storm Spear in his inventory. I'm liking that the desert has a whole whole entire like overhaul in this update. He's got the Scarab Bomb, which is this one. We've seen that in a previous uh, spoiler. He's got some sort of sandstone torches, and then he's got like a sandstone pickaxe. So I'm hyped for the desert in this update. 
Hopefully, uh, well, actually, I don't know. Never mind. That goes for all bombs. I, I was just gonna say, hopefully, that caves are more open. For example, the jungle caves are always my favorite caves because there's so much to explore and like zero dead ends. But the desert is pretty good about that too. But yeah, as you notice, there's a new cactus right here. Something else right here. I don't know if this is a rock or what, but there's something right there. Uh, we also got the new chest. Obviously, we'll get into that when they open the chest. But they're using the scarab bombs right now. New painting, Andrew Sphinx. I like that joke. Uh, there's boots, and then there's a flute. Now this flute 100% reminds me of the bard class. But I'm assuming what this flute is is from that spoiler with a cat the cat summon where the cat would just you would summon it with the with the music notes or whatever and it would just go around and attacking stuff. But look at this. What is this? A cookie? I don't know. Somebody broke a cookie in half. But yeah, new chests, new pot textures, and uh, a bunch of new desert items. So I'm I'm pretty hyped to explore the desert in this update because it seems like they overhauled the hell out of it. Well, what weapon was he using there? He's using the storm spear, right? Yeah. Uh, let me just check. So he, one thing is he's wearing the, uh, he's wearing the fossil armor. Now the fossil armor and the throwing class in general has been taken out in 1.4. That, that shit got assassinated. Like it's gone. It's no more. So I wonder what this set is now, whether it's a ranger set, is it a utility set? You know, utility set is like a armor set that has bonuses in like all around areas. I don't know. We'll see when the update comes out. I'm assuming it's going to be ranger set. Now here we go. Golf, 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 golf. If you guys follow my Twitter, you know that I'm I'm trying to assemble a big game of golf versus a bunch of other Terraria YouTubers. It would be the funnest thing ever. We'll have someone build the course for us. It's going to be fun. But this is 100% what I'm hyped for the most in 1.4. It's weird, right? That I'm hyped for golf. It's just so cool. It's such a cool idea. But yeah, as you can see, there's the putter. I'm assuming that's the nine iron, the big silver one. And obviously the other two clubs, whatever. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know golf like that. There's a whistle. What is that? A blue ball? And then there's a... the hell is this thing called? You stick it in the ground and you put the golf ball on it. I don't remember what they're called. But yeah, obviously you get like the power bar you hit the ball goes into the hole this whole animation and stuff for it now what i'm wondering is can you use the golf clubs as weapons that's what i'm wondering is it a new type of sub weapon you know what i'm saying subclass that'd be fun as you can see there when you score uh, obviously it says added score five current score 21 lila sunk the golf ball in was it one stroke nice there's obviously probably some new structures here too like new blocks and stuff i don't know if the volcano stuff is new this wall slash whatever this is looks somewhat new it has to be actuated right this looks like this is actuated um obviously the hole is new these blocks right here 100 percent look new same thing with the little pointy things here on the fence i haven't really said anything about the backgrounds a lot of the backgrounds are new uh there's some apples i don't know if those are apples or if those are just pumpkins painted red but uh, another plant right here that has an updated texture there's probably some things i've already missed like oh sandcastle look at that that's cool i like that there's also a bunch of updated textures pretty much updated textures everywhere i don't really need to point those out but we look over here to the right didn't even notice this not only is my girl right here wearing a bikini but there's this dope ass blue robe slash cape on this mannequin plus the little hat right here and you know i'm pretty hyped for mannequins in 1.4 because if you play moditory and you try to place armor on a mannequin that shit breaks bro so i'm pretty hyped that i'm gonna be allowed to place armors on mannequin again now look there's something right here i don't know if this is iron ore right here or what but there's an ore right here and i don't know what it is maybe it's just an updated iron ore texture but iron ore in the desert or in the beach i don't know i don't know man but obviously we got the new bestiary which i'm hyped for i think it's a really really cool idea once you kill a certain amount you unlock like the everything it drops and all the statistics and everything i think that's really cool i'm hyped for this all right right here see killed a bunch of skeletons who needs muscles or skins or eye or even eyeballs but it shows you all the stats and everything i like the idea now let's look at this filter here. This filter is gonna be kind of weird looking because uh, I have no idea how some of these work. We obviously got the forest biome slash the purity biome. Then we have daytime. Then we have, now this is a weird thing. I don't think there's any enemies that spawn during the uh, party event, but it's on here on the bestiary. And I don't think bestiary includes NPCs. So that means we might be getting some new party enemies, which is, which is interesting. Maybe it's like a party slime. I don't know. We also got like wind, like a little wind event. I know they spoiled something about that, didn't they? But there's like a wind event was the snow or is this just rain i don't know is that i what is this is a bottle <laughs> so that must mean there's there might be a good bit of enemies new enemies but obviously here uh in my original video i looked at these there's like a merman here thing is i don't know if this is a uh this has been in the game already i don't think it has pretty sure it hasn't then obviously we got the blood squid blood eel dribbler the blood fish fish eye i don't know the uh blood bloody goblin shark and then the bloody nautilus or blood nautilus something like that Speak about the blood nautilus is right here. Um, what else is this? Is this like a candle? What is this? You see this? 
I don't know what that is, but uh, this might be the new bamboo right here, I think. I don't know. It looks like bamboo. I know there's bamboo in the update. What else is there? There's this. You see this? What is this? You can hang banners on it. This little, like, fence background thing. I don't know what that is. It looks really cool, though. What else? That looked like there was something new on the floor right there. Right here. I don't know what that is. Uh, they probably have some new weapons, maybe. I can't tell <laughs> because this thing is in the way. That looks like a new crate right there. It looks like a cobalt crate. New fish, maybe? Or is that just salmon? That might be salmon. I don't know what that is in the tenth slot. But uh, there's a good bit of new things here. Obviously, we can see the blood squids. We see stars falling out of the sky. Um, let me see. Let me take I'm taking my mouse off the screen so we can see things more clearly. Chum caster. And then in his four slot, he has like a summon weapon or something. That's what it looks like. I, also, there might be a new buff right here. Look at that. Couple of new buffs. And he might have a pet flying around with him right there because of that thing. So, yeah, there's a couple of new buffs there. Master mode. I wonder how long this video is. <laughs> so, master mode. Look, he has a new pet again. Master mode, though. How is this going to work? I was told that master mode is not like expert mode. How expert mode adds in new, new attacks and new items and stuff, which is kind of upsetting. I honestly wish that it was a step up and it added in, you know, more content, even if it isn't like a lot of content. Added more content either in terms of like just more attacks. I don't know. I feel like it's just going to be boring. Just higher statistics. Like, we got mods if we want higher statistics. But right off the bat in master mode, we see weapons in the top left, blood rainbow, and then he's got a little summon staff for the frogs. I don't I don't see where the frogs are on the screen, but something for frogs. And then there is the uh, burgers and a new potion at the number nine slot. I don't know what that potion does. Right here, uh, I was talking about that the cat in the music notes. This is the cat right here. It's a summon, I think. Uh, he's using a quad barrel shotgun. And then in his one slot, he has something new that looks like a bottle two slot. Maybe that's the, the staff for the cat. So maybe the cat's not even related to the, the music flute. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is because I can't see it because the journey's and things in the way. <laughs> Let's just try and look at it here. He's so got like a tequila. He's got some food in the four slot. That might Wait, that might have been paper planes in the four slot. Is there paper planes in the games? That sounds like another thing I could do trick shots with. That looks like a paper plane. Number six looks like a drop. Right here, he's got the Celebration Mark II. So obviously, there has to be some additions to Master Mode. Look how big the projectiles are. There has to be some additions to Master Mode. There has to be like stronger weapons. I just feel like it's, it wouldn't be right if there was a stronger weapons. So maybe there's a couple new additions, but nothing crazy. But yeah, he either has a Harpy Pet or a Harpy Summon. So you can see it right here. A lot of new items, I think. I don't know. I can't, I can't really see them. Right here. Boom. Those pickaxes i can't tell if they're new if they're just stardust because i never use stardust um he's got something new in his five slot he's got some new ammo type and he's got pizza in his nine slot right here obviously the umbrella is new uh maybe these platforms down here are new yeah those platforms look new some of the blocks might be new too the door looks new who, who was building during all this man these are some nice builds bro we got these spike fences that we saw earlier the umbrella obviously looks cool the vanity set obviously is a new was there something new right there over here there's like some fog going on that looks cool so maybe when if you place a bunch of tombstones there's fog that starts coming out i don't know i like that though right here this block looks new i don't know i can't really tell obviously we got this thing i don't know what these things are called but they move in the wind and stuff uh picnic tables they look cool uh we got this thing too i uh, also don't know what that's called and then we got a banner flowing in the wind i really like the new weather effects they're really cool obviously kites kites are really cool uh, i guess everything's just really cool by my standards we got this little rosalina that's her name right rosalina uh she got luma luma I think it's the name of the star, but uh, yeah, from uh, Mario Galaxy. And then we got another new vanity on him. And then this is, what is this thing called? The shadow. Really cool. It's a really cool type of piggy bank, pretty much an item piggy bank. But yeah, in his inventory, that guy had Gladius slash Gladius, however you want to pronounce it. Then he had a shovel and he had a burger in his inventory. There might be another block he has in his two slot too. What is that? Yeah, he has something in his two slot. I don't know what that is. The kite, and then there's like a magic wand, a hot dog. And also, so hold up. Magic wand kite, number five is like a spike, and then she has a hot dog. Why does she have spikes in her inventory? That's interesting. But yeah, that's the end. That is the end of our little breakdown here. I don't know how long this video was. It felt really long. Oh, I can see it actually right here on OBS. 18 minutes. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I originally wasn't going to post a video today, but you know, I asked yesterday in the live stream if you guys wanted to see me do a breakdown. And a lot of people said, yeah. So here it is. And also, speaking about live stream, check out my Twitch, twitch.tv slash gamers101. I, I love you guys.